ENC Sports First is brought to you by 76 Circle K. Hey, Hoffman Guam. Hope your weekend was good. Good evening. Thanks for tuning in. My name is Blake Watson, and thank you for watching PNC Sports First. The Guam Rugby Women's Sevens team, they spent their weekend in South Korea for their second tournament of the month. Let's take a look. This time around, the tournament was hosted by South Korea in a tense match for fifth place and vital series points. Guam started strongly against Singapore and got a one-woman advantage when Singapore received a yellow card for a high tackle. Guam they were able they were not able to press this at home and they the defense saw a lapse and that gave them an early deficit five to nil Singapore. They continued the offensive momentum. They scored again, but Guam answers back fighting hard until Erica Kitsicho. She scores her ninth try of the tournament in this game. Team Guam, they kept moving the ball from lateral to lateral from side to side, but they were unable to break Singapore's defensive line and they ended the match down 10 to five. Guam did secure sixth place. That is an improvement on their seventh placing in the earlier Hong Kong tournament just earlier a couple of weeks ago. So shout out to them and thanks ladies for doing us proud over there. Double, I, Double AG moving on, had a busy weekend and we're here smack dab in the middle of first quarter sports. So George Washington, the girls volleyball and the boys football team both undefeated and they did everything they could to do so. They hosted Academy and JFK over the weekend, did the volleyball team and the football team. Undefeated preseason and regular season volleyball champs, GW Lady Geckos, host an undefeated academy. Cougar is able to play the Geckos tough and force a third set, but GW, they take it from there. It wasn't easy though. GW snap off a 10 and zero point run in the third set that to take the win and remain unbeaten over academy on their own home court. Over in double IAAG, double AG football, Geckos hosting JFK. The Islanders looking for a win after a tough battle that against Guam High last weekend, but not this time for JFK, just not their night. Geckos, they get contributions from Xavier Napati as well as Ross Bloss, and they up in the JFK Islanders 19 to seven on their own home field at GW. JFK, they play Southern this coming weekend as they look to bounce back. Meanwhile, GW, they will travel to the hill to face off against Guam High. Well, that'll wrap it up for me for the double IAAG recap and for Monday for me and the rest of the crew. My name is Blake Watson. See you at the game. NC Sports First is brought to you by 76 Circle K.